Introducing Macmillan McGee's patented electrothermal dynamic stripping process for the in situ thermal remediation of contaminated sites. Delivering the experience of over 75 successful projects. Urim Tech, partnering with Macmillan McGee to bring ET DSP to Europe. Our first project, a large creosote site. The site is characterized by complicated geology with multiple layers of varying lithology. Each lithology has its own unique hydraulic, thermal and electrical properties. The soil is contaminated with over 50 different chemicals. The contaminant distribution in the soil is even more complex than the geology. The heavier than water chemicals migrate through preferential pathways until their movement is obstructed by clays or an underlying aquitard. Chemicals that are lighter than water will migrate to the water table and accumulate there. So many different chemicals so randomly located in the soil makes it impossible to remediate using conventional multiphase extraction technologies. Without the help of heat, we know that it can take years, decades or centuries to reduce the contaminant mass in the soil. We need heat to treat. Heat helps mobilize the chemicals in the vapor and liquid phases. And the heating technology of choice is ETDSP, the electrothermal dynamic stripping process. Once the treatment volume boundaries are known, ETDSP begins with a conventional rig drilling vertical well bores to the bottom of the contaminated soil. Multiple electrodes are lowered into each well, strategically placed next to the contaminated soil. Extraction wells are drilled and connected to conventional surface facilities for the treatment and disposal of the extracted chemicals. Temperature sensors are placed extensively throughout the treatment volume to monitor the progress of heating and optimize the use of energy. A vapor cap provides thermal insulation, controlling fugitive emissions and optimizing chemical vapor extraction. Power delivery systems equipped with advanced internet-based computer control are used to evenly distribute electricity and water injection to the electrodes. A basic electrical resistance heating system typically has one electrode in a wellbore, limiting the capability to optimize heating of complex geology and control currents from taking the path of least resistance. Neutral currents can stray into the grounding of other electrical equipment, causing potential safety hazards. Convection is not implemented, reducing efficiency and uniformity of temperature. Extraction at electrodes removes heat where it is needed most. Conduction heating is a very slow process and without convection can cause overheating at the electrodes. ETDSP implements all the heat transfer mechanisms. Time distributed control ensures electrical energy is evenly shared between all electrodes. Interface synchronization ensures uniform electrical heating in complex geology. Proprietary grounding makes sure every electron is accounted for, so that stray currents do not interfere with other electrical systems or infrastructure. Overheating at electrodes is solved by injecting water using a balanced and optimized strategy from computer-controlled water circulation systems. Just enough water is injected to ensure maximum convective heat transfer and also to preserve the energy balance. Electrodes are sophisticated electrical components engineered to provide the heat transfer solution fundamentally needed for thermal remediation. With ETDSP, all the heat transfer mechanisms work together in synergetic proportion to achieve uniform heating. The electrothermal dynamic stripping process reaches the desired results more rapidly and evenly than any other in situ electrical resistance heating technology. With heat comes tremendously accelerated mass extraction. Vapors are generated, fluids flow with less resistance, chemicals are desorbed and dissolved, water turns to steam and strips away the chemicals. The permeability of the soil is greatly enhanced with increasing temperature. Extraction wells with properly designed well screens operating under vacuum pull the vapors and liquids rapidly from the soil, leaving the silts and sand material behind.
The ETDSP system, operating with a conventional multi-phase extraction system, in effect compresses the operating time to reach desired remediation goals from decades to months. There is little room for miscalculation. Everything has to work together in real time. We do the math first. We operate in the solution. We make operational decisions using real-time data, which we share with our clients, so that progress of a project can be monitored in an honest, transparent and cooperative team environment. An engaged team of professionals working from the same page is key to the success of a project. No remediation project is too small or too big for our team. We have worked on the largest in-situ thermal remediation project in the world to small source zone reduction programs. Let the electrothermal dynamic stripping process, our ETDSP technology, be the technology of choice for your thermal remediation needs.